Hey guys, Thunderstud here, showing you a new deck. Not a new archetype, but a new deck. It's Brotherhood of the Fire Fist. So we've had this archetype. They've been scattered into decks, not really its own archetype yet. But now it is. It's pretty strong. I don't know how competitive. It's, it's pretty strong though. It's not bad at all. You'll see in the replays. So the boss monster is Brotherhood of the Fire Fist Horse Prince. Uh, he's the only synchro monster I have in the deck, so just three of him. That's because of the limitations on our tuner. But that's all you're using. He's the one boss monster. So I'll start from the beginning now. We have Brotherhood of the Fire Fist Bear. Once per turn, when this card inflicts battle damage to your opponent, you can set one spell or trap from the deck. Or once per turn, you can send one spell and target one monster and destroy that monster. That's usually what we're going to be using. So here's our tuner. Uh, it can only be used as a tuner for a Beast Warrior type monster. The only Beast Warrior type monsters are Fire Fist monsters, so we're stuck with that. Um, when you summon it, it's like uh, Junk Synchron, but for level 3 uh, Fire Fist monsters with a very strict limitation. They have to have 200 or lower defense. So that's not many, it's only two, and the two that we're using. So we're using Leopard and Rooster. So, uh, and that's pretty much the end of uh, this guy's effect. So, now Leopard, he's probably the best. Maybe if you have three, put three over this Gorilla. The Gorilla is just like the bear, but he works for spell and traps. So you would send one of your spells and you target a spell and trap where he sends one of your spells, you target a monster. So one of them's okay. I'd probably use a third Leopard if I had it. So Leopard really gets it going quick. You can summon Leopard and he can tribute himself to bring out any uh, fire formation spell or trap card. So you summon your Leopard, tribute him for a Tensu. Use the Tensu to now summon your Spirit. Your Spirit will grab the Leopard out of the graveyard and uh, that'll make your Synchro. Your Synchro also special summons a level 3, usually a Rooster, when uh, he's summoned. Rooster, when he's special summoned, you get a search one Fire Fist monster from your deck to your hand. He also has a second effect where he can send one spell to the graveyard and then search a whole nother spell and set it. So pretty useful. Uh, Leopard's really the MVP. So as for spells, we have Gyoku. This sees a lot of play or saw a lot of play in old meta as a staple. They can't chain. It just silences one spell or trap and they can't chain to its activation. They can't chain where you're targeting. Here you know what Econs are. This is a new fire formation. Yoko, you target one card, discard a beast warrior, which all fire fists are, and you destroy that card. Tensu is another old one. I think it's from the card trader. It lets you normal summon an extra fire fist monster on your turn. Very useful. And then we have Tencent. I think this is new. It pretty much gives you a thousand damage in the damage phase, so it's pretty useful. Um, the the skill we're using is Field of Warriors for a little more attack. Most spells will give you attack also, so they get kind of beefy. Beefy enough. Um, it's it's pretty fast. They swarm the board real quick. I don't know exactly what to do with them. You'll see in the replays. It's pretty cool stuff. I hope you guys enjoy. Thanks. Okay, so... We're in the King of Games bracket, so I try to get the most competitive decks with the best replays I can show you. People, as I'm always saying, people always surrender a lot, people always give up quick. But I think I got some good ones, so let's see. Field of Warriors. It's pretty useful, you know, the skill's pretty flexible. You can use whatever you want, really. If only we had a level 7 tuner. The other tuner for Fire Fist is level 8, so you can't really get that out. I don't even have him in the extra deck. Here we're fighting Blue Eyes. This is pretty much the strongest start we could do. It's not really an ideal start at all, but it's good that we have the tents in. That really makes it a pretty decent start. Here we get our rooster. We get hit by a treacherous trap hole. Crazy, but thanks to spirit, we get our second normal summon. Thanks to Tensu. Special summon our rooster. When rooster is special summoned, he searches any fire fist from the hand. We search bear. Synchro summon. Get our horse prince out. Horse Prince special summons when he is summoned. Only level 3 so. Special summon a rooster. Or to use rooster's effect. Doesn't matter. We hit for game. I BM with the Tencent just because. And uh, yeah, real quick. Swarms the board. 
get some roosters out, lots of searching. That's usually what you need to make a good deck, so pretty cool. So that last one was really quick. This one should probably be a little longer. Uh, it feels like a fast deck, but I want to say it's not a fast deck. Um, with all the attack boosters, even though our monsters are so weak, only 1500, 1600, they break 2k pretty easily, so you can s threaten lethal, but it's not really consistent OTKs. So let's see what we're fighting here. Again, not a very good hand to start off with, but I think what we're fighting doesn't have a very good hand either. So here, start with our Tensu. Normal summon one bear. Normal summon the second bear. Use bear's effect to destroy a monster. All you gotta do is send a card. Then double attack with our bear. This is perfect. He's already crippled because we get him so low. He doesn't have the life points to pay for any of his vampire effects. Here he's using Kaiba Corp Bling. So this is the deck that won the Casey Cup that we're beating right here. He definitely got an Inkon. Uses his field spell. Pulls out a Queen. This is where I get desperate. Gotta use my e own Prismatic Econ. Take a uh, Sacrifice a Bear. Grab the Queen. Don't let him attack or swing. He sets one card. It's definitely that Econ. Here. Summon the Rooster. Use our Tensu. Activate Bear Effect. Bear Effect was gonna destroy Queen. Instead, he uses his Econ. Prismatic Econ. That's what he searched. To steal our Brotherhood of the Fire Fist Bear. Steals our bear, but wait, we have our trap card, gives you a ton of damage. I uh, pretty much BM again and get rid of it and give you Tensu. Pretty much the same thing. Swing over for the damage remaining. Quick plays against a really strong deck. So pretty cool, pretty strong. Lots of stuff going on, lots of stuff from outside the deck. Pretty interesting. So I would say an ideal hand would be uh, a leopard. A tuner, a spirit, sorry, the tuner is the spirit. And then, really, as long as you have those two, your combo started, so just fill it from there, maybe your econs. Going first, this deck builds a pretty strong board going first. Kill the warriors. We start with our leopard, no tuner, but starting with your leopard always gives you options. We're gonna use them outright. Bring out our trap. Place one Tensu face up. Normal summon our gorilla. Remember, gorilla is just like bear, just uh, different. So here, we're fighting what is most likely the Yubel Cerulean Sacred Dragon kind of thing. Uh, he searched for a spell card. I think it failed. Is what that was. So he didn't find one. Set our Econ, swing over him nice and easy. We don't really have a great hand of our own. Normal summons a uh, Disciple. Here it's important, this is the second time I've Econ took to break up a combo. Now you can see what uh, Fire Fist can do to a vulnerable field with just the Spirit, how it swarms. So we summon our Leopard, Synchro Summon into our... To the animation. Three stars. So if I had more leopards, I'd probably put more leopards, but uh, I don't. So here we have our horse prince. Activate his effect when he summons. He special summons rooster. Rooster also has an effect when he special summon. He lets you search anything. I still have a normal summon. Normal summon bear. Pretend this monster is scary. We send our tensu and destroy it. Summon another tensu. Tons of damage, 3500, 2k swinging at each side, goes really fast, Horse Prince is pretty strong, so it swarms the field really quick, you build their attacks really high, you shut down the monsters, you shut down all the, all the back row with your Gyokus, it works out pretty well, it's a pretty fast deck, cool stuff guys, thanks.